Good afternoon. Um, it is uh, Your Holiness, Chairperson of the uh, conference, esteemed delegates. Uh, I will begin my address to you by sharing my passion and my friend, musician Igeta, will help me. You see the traditional Latvian instrument she is holding, and she will play on it. Rīce kalnis kā nemeži, ai, aha, skā nemeži, kā dziedāju gāvīlē, dziedo dzīmu, dziedo taugu, ai, I was born singing, I grew up singing, I lived my life singing. Mountains were trembling and uh, forests were echoing when I was singing. Uh, this was a uh, story of this very small song. Uh, the tradition of singing, which is typical for most nations, is certainly a passion for Latvians and is an integral part of our lifestyle and culture. Singing is also source of uh, my inspiration and a spiritual strength I'd like to share with you today. The Latvian singing tradition is rooted in an old mythical, in the old mythical understanding and view of the world. Its roots are deep in the Latvian language. You can see the language tree on the screen. Um, and uh, the Latvian language is one of the uh, still living Baltic languages that belong to the oldest Indo-European uh, language tree. Uh, look at the screen and pay attention to some basic words in Latvian. Words such as dziedāt, to think, dzimt, to be born, dzīvot, to live, and dziedināt, to heal, all come from one root. And this shared symbolic relationships in the sense of the world is alive in today's global Latvian woman, which is the living heiress and keeper of the rich, intangible heritage of my country. The greatest treasure of Latvian culture is a huge collection of Dainas, an oral folk poetry that has been created mostly by women for hundreds or even thousands of years. Basically, uh, these are compositions of four lines, uh, which have been transmitted by singing from one generation to another generation. Only in the second half of 19th century, the folk songs began to be recorded. Before that, all wisdom of ancestors was transmitted uh, in an oral way. Uh, the largest collection of Dianas is stored in the cabinet of the folk songs at the Latvian National Library, and that includes more than one million texts and around 30,000 tunes. It has been recognized by UNESCO as a precious documentary value of the memory of the world. In terms of content, the Dainas, or folk songs, focus on the Latvian's traditional, or we uh, say also in Europe, uh, pagan worldview, based on two great cyclical circles. The circle of human life from cradle to grave, and the na nature's cyclical process, the seasons changing with the pass of sun. Latvian still survives the need for an emotional connection with nature, and traditional rituals and associated songs help to renew and express these feelings. You wouldn't find many modern nations 
uh, which um, have established the days of the summer solstice as official holidays. We have in Latvia. Th uh, this is a traditional feast with, uh, with cheese and beer and houses decorated with various grasses, flowers and uh, branches. Women weave crowns of flowers for themselves and crowns of oak leaves for their menfolk. The repertoire of summer solstice songs is so rich that we can and we should uh, sing all night in order to greet the sun as it rises through the darkness. It is important to note uh, that the sun in the Latvian traditional culture is always feminine and often in relationships with the moon and the thunder. Uh, the sun in Latvian folk songs can also be used as a metaphor to denote the loving mother. In Latvian mytholo mythology and folklore, the woman has a major role to play. The cult uh, of motherhood rules here, where every natural phenomenon has its own mother, earth mother, forest mother, mother of the sea, mother of the wind, as well as mothers of destiny uh, who are able to take care of the most important things for a favorable outcome of the course of human life. For Latvians, the singing tradition is not limited to the layer of folklore. It has also played an important role in the history of the self-confidence of Latvian people and formation of national identity. In this respect, uh, we have to speak about the Latvian Song Celebration Festival. In the, it, it has burned in the middle of the 19th century when singing in the United Choirs in the nationwide song celebration festivals became the first form of the emerging Latvian nation. The Latvian state has burned through singing of its people. Uh, that is why, why we consider song celebration festival a cradle of our independent state. Moreover, uh, in the course of history, singing together in a mass choir have developed and consolidated into a mighty spiritual weapon that has helped the nation to overcome difficult times and without violence, to gain independence in 1918, to survive and resist during 50 years of Soviet occupation, to survive exile and uh, deportations to Siberia, and to regain the independence in 1990. In the world's history, the non-violent resistance of the Baltic people is known as singing revolution. It is because the song became the main weapon for expressing the will of people and also its shield to protect people. These days, the tradition and symbolism of the song and dance celebrations in Estonia, Latvia, and Lithuania are recognized by UNESCO as masterpiece of the oral and tangible heritage of humanity. Um, and we Latvians are less than two millions uh, living in Latvia and spread around the globe. But Song Celebration Festival is a tradition that bounds us all together it is like a voice of the mother that calls all the children back and uh, maintains the sense of belonging. For me, as a woman, uh, singing is, a, is as a means to express my emotions, to manage my emotions, uh, to cope uh, psychologically with life's difficulties, to lighten my workload, and to meditate uh, to calm down or sometimes vice versa, to boost my energy. When I was minister, I was singing before the hot talk interviews and it really helped me a lot. So, and one of the songs I, 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 I was singing, uh, I uh, will perform in the conclusion of my presentation, again with the help of Igeta. And this is a song which says that I put all my worries under the stone and I step over by singing. Bad man, little bad, 
bēdu un mānu lielu bēdu, es par bēdu nebēdāju. Ramtai, ramtai, radīdi rīdi, ramtai rīdi, ralala. Ramtai, ramtai, radīdi rīdi, ramtai rīdi, ralala. Liku bēdu zem akmeņa, pāri gāju dziedādam. Liku bēdu zem akmeņa, pāri gāju dziedādam. Ramtai rīdi, radīdi rīdi, rīdi, ramtai rīdi, ralala. Ramtai rīdi, radīdi rīdi, ramtai rīdi, ralala.